All right, Renee, she was uh, talking music earlier today at Humphreys by the Bay in Shelter Island. So all morning she's been getting the scoop on this concert lineup and some great grub. Renee? Good morning, guys. Aretha Franklin, Nora Jones, Sarah McLaughlin, amazing artists. And the thing they have in common, they have all played right here at Humphreys by the Bay. An amazing concert season coming in this year. And it's all kicking off with the first really big show tomorrow night. Steve Miller Band and Chef Nick, you get a cook for them all. <laughs> yeah. It's definitely, it's definitely interesting at times, um, but exciting. I mean, you have to imagine these guys are on the road. These ladies and gentlemen are on the road constantly. Um, for them to have a great meal is really special for them. Now, Seal right behind us here, gosh, he's been touring for a long time. Any, any interactions with him? Um, you know, I've never cooked for him, but I went to see him at Chastain in Atlanta, outdoor show, incredible artist. Yeah, he is yeah. phenomenal. Uh, Kenny G, what does he like to eat? Um, I'm not sure, but he definitely plays the saxophone. <laughs> okay, all right, we're on the same page with that. Yeah. So there's so many incredible artists in this season, starting off with the big show Steve Miller Band, Ringo Starr playing July 1st. What are some of your other favorite shows that are coming here? Um, I'd have to say ZZ Top, Gypsy King's my all-time favorite, um, Bob Dylan, that's huge. I mean, my mom would probably cry if she knew that uh, he was coming here. But, you got uh, tickets to that show, right? Well, I, I'll be in the kitchen cooking. Well, I think you should get that night off and enjoy. Yeah, you know what? Uh, what I'll put I, in a good word for you. Oh, no, thanks. What I do is I actually cook, and then I go out and I, I check the bands out every night. Oh, so. good. Oh, your job sounds tough. Yeah, it's horrible. A tough gig. Okay, so all of these amazing artists have come to play here. Ringo Starr is going to get his picture up here because he's coming, and one of my all-time favorites, we've got Cheryl Crow. Man. She's just amazing. Have you cooked for her? I haven't, but I've admired her. Um. <laughs> yeah, stand in line, buddy. Who hasn't? Who hasn't? Who is your favorite celebrity that you have uh, ever cooked for? Uh, probably Robert De Niro. He's a true gentleman and a very, very good, good man, very good family man. We're yeah. going to go in this room where there's some more cool pictures. This is the backstage lounge. Okay, so what about Robert De Niro made him so cool to cook for? Well, I mean, I was so starstruck, and I never get starstruck, but he is particularly one of my favorite actors. Um, he just was such a normal person, and I'll never forget that his, uh, his kids were running around in their underwear <laughs> in the room, and he's, he said, hey, what are you doing? You know, like, and I, all I could picture was him in the movies, you know? Yeah, right. It was really weird, but uh, he's, he's just an outstanding guy. What was his favorite dish? Uh, he likes pasta. Obviously, he's Italian, yeah. so we, he ordered spaghetti bolognese, I think, every day that oh, he was there. Oh, I don't know where he puts it. He's still in great shape. He is. He is. He's, uh, he, I think those people really do actually work out. I so. think so. <laughs> We've got so many great shows this season, and there are going to be some really fun 70s and 80s shows, a little throwback. Yeah, I mean, I can remember the 80s vaguely, uh, <laughs> but uh, ZZ Top's a big one, like I said before. They're, they're, they're so energetic, and it was just um, the memories, you know, uh, music is a big trigger for memory. M music and food, actually. So when they come, we definitely we go the extra mile for them, um, and they have some great fans. Thank you so much, Chef Nick, for joining us. He gets to cook for all the artists and all the stars, and you can come here and enjoy. Oh, so many great memories here, and let's make some new ones this season from the Steve Miller Band all the way through the summer concerts, and it's going to be an amazing season. Linda, Clint?